Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to enable the Microsoft Print to PDF feature in Windows 11 and then also in Windows 10. It's a similar procedure, but this will get you going for both operating systems. So by default, Windows comes with the Microsoft Print to PDF feature, which allows you to create PDFs from your files just by going to the print menu there. And it should be enabled by default, but sometimes you know something might happen or someone might have disabled it and you need to re-enable it. So it's a pretty simple thing to fix. So we have this notepad file here, and let's say we wanted to create a PDF from it. Normally we'd go to File and Print and pick a Microsoft Print to PDF from here, but we can see it's missing. So we just need to add it back real quick, and then we'll be back in business. So the easiest way for Windows 11 is to click on Search here, Search for Optional Features. And then if you scroll down, you'll see you have you know various things that have been installed by default, Notepad and... Windows, Fax and Scan, and so on. But if you scroll down to the bottom, click on More Windows Features, then you'll have this list here, which you might be used to seeing in Windows 10. And then find Microsoft Print to PDF, check the box, click OK. And then it's real quick, click on Close, and close this out. Don't even need to reboot or close your file. Go back to File and Print. And now we have Microsoft Print to PDF. So let's go ahead and try this real quick. Let's save it to the desktop. Let's call this test. All right, so there's our PDF. Simple as that. So for Windows 10, if you go to the Windows 10 app for the optional features, it's not going to look the same. So the easiest way for that for Windows 10 is to go to Control Panel. And then you could go to uh, Programs and Features. And then turn Windows Features on or off. And you'll have the same list. Check the Microsoft Print to PDF, and then you should be good to go. All right, so pretty simple, yeah? So if you're missing it, just follow those steps, and you'll be uh, printing PDFs again. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.